the CMB map with its hot spots and cold spots essentially provides a cosmological blueprint. The slightly hotter regions represent areas where the universe was slightly denser and would eventually grow to become clusters of galaxies. The slightly colder regions were underdense and would evolve into cosmic voids. It is the furthest back in time we can see directly, as the universe was opaque before the CMB was released. We cannot see beyond the surface of last scattering because any light emitted before that time would have been immediately scattered by the dense plasma. The CMB also allows cosmologists to precisely constrain the age of the universe at about 13.8 billion years and confirms its composition with roughly 5% ordinary matter, 27% dark matter and 68% dark energy. The cosmic microwave background continues to be an invaluable tool for cosmologists offering a wealth of information about the Big Bang, its initial conditions, and the fundamental properties that govern our universe. Its study remains at the forefront of cosmological research continually refining our understanding of the cosmos. The universe at its birth, as revealed by the cosmic microwave background, was remarkably smooth and uniform. Yet when we look around us today, we observe a universe filled with intricate and massive structures. Stars clustered into galaxies, galaxies grouped into clusters, and these clusters arranged in vast cosmic filaments, separated by immense empty voids. This striking transformation from a nearly homogeneous early state to the highly clumpy universe we inhabit is one of the most compelling narratives in cosmology.